Bye, guys. <laughs> she said Emma. See y'all in May. <laughs> Load it up. Alright, guys. Leaving the camper. Got everything cleaned. Super exhausted. We should have took a rest day. But two years in the camper. Now. What's that? are all loaded up <laughs> we're loaded up and we're leaving we're gonna go visit mom and granddad before we actually officially hit the road goodbye campers Cheer. had to come see mom before we headed out love you love you too mom oh i look old <laughs> so you did a whole cross-country trip yourself yeah you have fun oh well, you know going across the mountains i could see everything you know yeah no view, blockage, or nothing. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I just went across like this. I went in Oklahoma. I probably went down this way. On your motorcycle? Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> the first night sleeping, we're at a rest stop. Kentucky. It's 11 p.m. There's our vehicle. Is it 12 here? 12 here. Okay. That's what it looks like. We are sleeping here tonight. Our first night sleeping in the car. How you doing? <laughs> so we know if Say is eating and drinking, she is just fine. Look at her. Good night, everybody. First night, sleeping in the... Uh, we got a pretty comfortable mattress. Good night, guys. Good morning. <laughs> it was a great night in the camper. It was solid, super toasty. Definitely had to crack the windows because all the all the all the stuff at all 50 degrees out. and the bed because like the before the wind was coming through so yeah. but it was great it was roomy we slept better than we've had in a while That's so good. where are we going st louis <laughs> Now we went through Kentucky, now we're in Illinois. We are headed to St. Louis. There we are. For gas, I have no idea where we are. We just passed Mount Vernon. We're going to be going to a campground for two days.
Okay, where are we? Columbia, Missouri. Snack stop. Bathroom break. Gas fill up. It's a rainy one. They didn't have Burns Group here, so we're going to old school. Mr. Finn. I got snacks. That's not bad. Teamwork. <laughs> we left the campsite. We left the campsite a day early because it was so rainy. Tax right off. We couldn't even hardly do anything. Um. Uh, so now we are on our way to Omaha, Nebraska. Okay. But hopefully, by the time we get there, it'll be like seven o'clock in rush hour. You go to Odessa, Oak Grove. You come on up. We're about to go through Kansas City. We are getting some gas. Letting say I have a little breather. Where are we? I don't know. Okay, we're in Iowa now. That's where we ended up. We're going to sleep tonight at the Love's truck stop. We're going to get a little snack first and then go to bed. We're pretty tired. We just drove four hours, I think, maybe five. Not much. <laughs> 39 degrees. We're getting ready to crawl into bed. It's 12.10 a.m. 39 degrees. It's gonna be low of 25. Really? <laughs> Is it? We're gonna have to get toasty in our blanket. 6 a.m. is supposed to snow. 30% chance. Oh my gosh. Hey, honey. We woke up to a blizzard, like full snow. Hello friends, I'll just take a little break in this video to let you guys know uh, if you would like to support us further. Uh, we have a few links in our description. We have Patreon, which I'm working on. It's kind of exclusive content for anybody who signs up. One of the biggest things is uh, buy us a coffee. <laughs> we love coffee. Um, so that's in the description if you'd like to buy us a coffee. Uh, I post that on social media, Facebook and Instagram, and we appreciate it. Uh, if you follow us on Facebook and Instagram, you see a lot more behind the scenes content post every single day. Uh, little backstories and fun things that are happening that I don't really put on YouTube. Uh, our Amazon store is also linked in the bio. Uh, it's actually stuff that we have bought, tried, tested, and used. Uh, so anything you buy from that store gives us a little commission. Um, but we're gonna keep getting better at content for you guys and pushing that out. And any direct support that you give us, we appreciate, Saya appreciates. We love you guys and thank you so much for watching and the continued support. Okay, okay, back to the video, right? Good morning, Saya. So we sleep on the bed, obviously, at night. And then when we wake up in the morning, normally yeah. him, we'll transfer everything from the front seats to the mattress. It said 30% chance of snow. And then we woke up for four hours of straight snow. This is not crazy temperatures. Only high 20s, not too bad.
I sure didn't expect to wake up to heavy snow. Um, last night it was going to be cold, but just had like a little sprinkle of chance of snow. And now it's like heavy snow for hours. It's so cool to see it though. As a Tennessean, we, we don't see snow often, so I'm definitely freaking out a little bit. It's made me very happy. He's used to snow. I'm not yeah. used to snow. He's a snow boy. I love it. This is awesome. Like I said, <laughs> there's snow, but it's low temperature, so it's, it's legit. I guess we're still in Iowa. I gotta pee. and Iowa, almost a Sioux city, Sioux Falls, where we're going to stay the night. Beautiful red belly robin over there, just chilling, enjoying life in this mild, snowy, blizzard. <laughs> blizzard. Hey, honey. Okay. Barely see the buildings in the back. Omaha City. Apparently Rachel's fascinated with snow plows because she's never seen one, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna highlight the snow plow. <laughs> yes. We got sunshine for the first time on our trip. It's beautiful. We're gonna enjoy it, let everything melt into frost. On our way to Sioux Falls for the night. Just doing a little bit of cleaning up, trying to stay organized. Here comes my beautiful darling Rachel. Look at that beautiful sunset right behind her. Look at that beautiful sunset. It's so pretty. Yeah. We got some stuff on our bed right now, but this is my closet. That's our bathroom stuff. Clothes are in there. We'll give you a full tour later. Doing a little bit of cleaning up before we settle in. We're getting reorganized here. This right here is strictly the beer cooler. <laughs> this is our refrigerator, water containers, cooler for certain beverages, and this is our toilet if we need it. Cooking side table for Grill rack, which we've already used to cook on. Yep. And if you want a hitch like this with this amazing bag, you can go to my Amazon store and get you one. It's awesome. It really is. It's been amazing. Always oh, about 500 pounds. Yeah. <laughs> he likes being outside. Eli's going to fill up the water tank for us at the Walmart. Look at that. Good girl. Say so is getting her food for the night. We got some big hot hands. Good girl. Right now it is only 39 degrees. We're gonna stay toasty warm in our bed. Good morning. My deodorant's frozen solid. Oh, that's why she's on a hill because you have the Another great morning. So it's for, I think the third day in a row now. We woke up, up exactly at 7.30. Pretty much approximately six hours solid sleep. And I feel great. Uh, it was 20 degrees last night and we slept pretty solid. The only thing is we got to fix is get the insulation up with some cloth on it just because the condensation and then crack the windows. Because we did that the previous night. But last night we wanted to see like how bad it would be with versus cold and our heat and obviously more condensation because it's freezing and our body heat and everything but yeah so we're gonna get that nip down and then we're going up to even say a snuggle with us our new our new campsite for a couple days at right there off a nice nice river 
get the Missouri River. Missouri River, yeah. Pokemon Go. Playing our Pokemon Go. Cleaning our teeth. He already did his. Saya just ate her breakfast. And it's currently 24 degrees, but we're we're fine. The sun's out. Feels good. Hi, Saya. You come and say hi. So we decided, though, the best thing is when while we're traveling is to have her safe in her bag so she doesn't keep choosing different spaces that that feel safe because she knows the car is safe she knows the bag safe but when she hears these loud trucks that are coming through she generally just bolts to wherever she gets confused and just like super anxiety attack so we figured out when you were driving we keep her inside and when we're and then obviously when we're, we're sitting idled or at nighttime we let her do her thing because obviously cats are nocturnal and we don't want to take away her her play time and obviously her feeding time we also put some uh Hot hands underneath her for nighttime. If you made it this far, I really appreciate it. Thank you guys for sticking around. Next video, we end up on the Missouri River and we meet a local named Dave. Uh, we end up making a beautiful fire. We cook some really good food. We have an amazing sunset and a really great night's sleep in our converted forerunner.